a snake. Oh, look at there. I found me a baby northern water snake. Not exactly a baby, but little. Now, water snakes like this Neurodia sipidin are actually harmless. I mean, obviously, since they have a mouth, they can bite, but they're not going to send you to the hospital or anything like that. And they feed primarily on fish, and sometimes frogs and other things. But fish are actually their preferred item on the menu. Now, little perks like that are exactly what herping's all about. You know, I'm here looking for salamanders and filming a YouTube video. And you wind up seeing all sorts of really awesome things when you're doing so. So I highly recommend you guys get outdoors and uh, enjoy yourselves. On to the next spot, guys. Now, unfortunately, a big pet peeve of mine is the fact that people often mistake water snakes with moccasins, also known as cotton mouths. Let me tell you, they are not the same species. In fact, you live, if you live in the northeastern United States, you're not going to see any moccasins or cotton mouths. That's a southern species. Well, both species may be dark brown in color once they reach adulthood, and they both thrive in the same environments, near water and wooded hillsides and things like that. Um, they are totally different species. And as I said, once you're up north, you're not going to see any moccasins. Another thing to keep in mind is a moccasin will often open its mouth and flash the inside, which is bright, bright white. Hence the name Cottonmouth. Thanks a lot for watching. And remember, if you like this video, be sure to check out this video over here that YouTube has selected specifically for you based on your watch time. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button, but you gotta click the bell icon, because if you don't, YouTube will never let you know when a new video of mine comes out. And remember, passion inspires spirit. Chris Ignato, signing out.